Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Well, we're on, we're chewing the, we're chewing the morning pipe this morning, and cracking on with some uh, plumbing work, which is going to entail providing a hot and cold water feed over here, where I've conveniently indicated hot and cold, and also a waste pipe. We're going to run that. We're going to sling it below this gas pipe over here, run it all the way across and into this yet to be painted or tiled, we'll see, uh, cupboard which boxes in the pipework at the bottom of the sink. So that will allow us then, as I said on yesterday's vlog, to plumb in that hand wash basin for the benefit of our meat handler Matt, the sous chef, who he handles everybody's meat in the kitchen. And uh, once that's done today, I need to pop a little bit of grout into this tile work, and then we'll push all this lot back. You'll notice the floor's clean, Stuart's been down here and given it a good old mopperoo. And then once all that's pushed back, I've just got a little fitting. This thing, it's really tricky to make, to find an appliance nozzle that goes into push fit, but I managed to get one. And this, I'm hoping, if I just put the other kitchen lights on, there, I'm hoping we'll go into this pipe up here with a little help from maybe a, a 90, and then we can tie that pipe work up and get it out the way. So we've got a functioning glass wash. I'm going to bang my head on the door there, look. So there we have it. Glass wash will be done. The microwave for heating up puds and saucers has been put into its new position. The new cut down tables in here, we did this uh, just the other day, you may recall. I don't know how much of that I got on film. Uh, but yeah, I better get cracking like, because sooner or later I need to go into the unit and put the first coat of top coat onto the resin floor from what we primed yesterday. It's half past twelve. We've got the pipe work installed. Thank you. Varnish required. And then it runs all the way along the back of here to this section there. You see that pipe work? Beautiful, very nice, looking good. And yes, we do now have hot and cold running water at the meat prep area. Check it out. I'm very happy with that. So we've got a hand wash. Need to stick this little tile back on here. I took it off because, uh, well, it didn't fit with the other table, but now I can put it back on again. Bit of a dick move taking that off, weren't it? Anyway, let's. Uh, I think I threw it in the bin. Might be able to find it in here. Probably not worth it. I'll just cut another one. Time now to put a coat on this primer. I can walk on it. You can hear it's a little bit tacky, but you can't see my footprints look, so it's kind of, I think, good to go. I'm not going to bother putting any uh, spikes on, I don't think. So let's mix up some of this resin coat and get it on the deck. And the final result, after three tins of top coat, another top coat to go on tomorrow and then we'll be done or the brewery will be blue and hopefully workshop red looking good nice to see another fantastic repair hello mate <laughs> by uh, Nottingham County Council check that out Skills, they've even left a little bit outside at road for us, look. 
Look at the fucking state of it, honestly. Just come along with a hammer and kind of just whack tarmac into an hole. Think that's going to do anything. It'll be out within a week. So we're pretty much finished up in here apart from cleaning. There's still a lot of cleaning to do because every time somebody pulls something out I get behind there and make a mess. Uh, everything's plumbed in. All the pipe work and everything's all plumbed in. Nice bit of electrician's tape down there to do the job. <laughs> of course, that's what all good plumbers use, isn't it? But we've still got all this front of house to do. It's in a right state. So I'm sure there's a few things that I need to do up here, but I can't remember what they are. To do with jiggling tables around, I believe. Changing the leg positions on these tables or something like that. And then reinforcing this little section here. We'll see. We'll see, I'm not sure. It's kind of uh, kind of time to take it all out, really, I think. Start again. Who knows? But we're getting there. We're getting there. Yeah, I'm kind of ready for home. It's not even uh, not even two o'clock yet, I don't think. That's all the jobs finished for today. Well, I say all the jobs finished. I've finished doing jobs for today, is another way of putting it, I think. We did have some ducks down here a minute ago. Oh, they're up there, look. We've been feeding the ducks. So, the girl from the pizza place next door has brought us some duck food out. But they've buggered off. So, there we go. I thought I'd give you a lovely view of the Chesterfield before we wrap up the vlog. Something else I noticed as well. Look at that tree over there. That one growing out the side of the uh, bridge. Look at the roots on it. Looks absolutely balmy. Like the roots have got to be four foot tall out of the base of that, well, where it's meant to be growing from. Anyway, small things and all that, you know. So there we go, boys and girls, ladies and gents. That's another day in the bag. Uh, what are we on? Thursday. So yeah, five days, six days until we open. Cheers. Now there's a few. <laughs>